Since most hypothesis testing involves determining if two or more uh, samples are have the same or different means or variances, uh, I created a statistical wizard in the QI macros. As long as your data is in columns like this, you simply select it with your mouse, click on the QI macros menu, and there's a stat wizard over here on the far left, and it'll look at that data and figure out what are the various things it can do with this. And then it'll come back and tell you the variances are the same, the means are different. And so for the variances, it's done what's called a Levine's test. And for the means, it's in this case, because there were two, there were four samples instead of just two, it did an ANOVA. And because it's not quite sure, and these were all integers, it went ahead and did a chi-square to say, evaluate whether these things are dependent or independent. So that will very quickly go about getting you the answer you're really looking for when you're doing uh, hypothesis testing. The same with two samples. Here we have Catalyst 1 and Catalyst 2, and we want to know if they're the same or different. And again, you just click on the stat wizard, and it'll look at that and go, well, I have to do an F test to determine uh, if the variances are the same, and then choose which kind of t test I need to use. And so it'll go off and do that. And because there's two columns here, it's also going to go out and do regression analysis, just for grins. Uh, again, it's not quite sure what all is you're trying to do here, but it's going to guess and test. But in this case, the variance is the same and the means are the same. If you go back, you'll see here's our F test. And so <clears throat> the P values are greater than 0.05. And in this case, the T tests are um, the same. So that's how easy it is to go out and start to do these analyses. And if you need to change that for any reason, you can just change your alpha value here. It's, there's nothing to that. You just change it to 0.1 or whatever. Although, in this case, that really wouldn't matter because the means are equal. And so that quickly accelerates your ability to do the kinds of testing we're looking for in, uh, in Excel using the QI macros to do hypothesis testing quickly to find out if the means and the variances are the same or different. You can download a 30-day trial of the QI Macros at qimacros.com.